the state police command in collaboration with operatives of the intelligence response team and delta state police command have apprehended a most wanted crime lord in the state peter aka daddy chuku peter daddy chuku aka oboni a native of omok in river state was a notorious gangster whose criminal enterprise was multifaceted bordering on cultism, kidnapping, murder, assassination, amongst other crimes. Commissioner of Police C.P. Ola Tunji Disu, in a news briefing at the state headquarters, said that Ichuku became an item of deep interest when on the 13th of January, he and his murderous band shot and killed the Community Development Committee Chairman of Mbumo Simiri Ndidi Livingstone as he was stepping out of church service in Rumwemu. I want to thank the Commissioner of Police Delta State for his cooperation and for deploying his men to enhance this operation even without informing him earlier. He simply told us crime has no boundary and he was very happy to deploy his men. I want to thank all officers of the River State Police Command, the IRT for their commitment towards the success of this operation. I want, and at the same time, I want to commend the officers who took active part from the commencement of this operation till the end. I also appreciate a very key stakeholder, that is the community, and everybody who provided us necessary information. I want to thank all residents of the state. They have been wonderful, and they have been cooperating with us. All information we wanted, they were supplying it to us. A representative of Mbo Shimini community, Livingstone Wedge. Some victims and relations besieged the command headquarters to express their appreciation to the state police in their efforts to bring peace to their community. The peace have come and gone. Many waters have gone under the bridge. Compromises here and there. But you've given a different story that the police can be relied upon and we are not taking it for granted, sir. So we want to especially thank you, sir. I'm asking that you shouldn't relent. Our community is still under threat. These criminal gangs and their known sponsors, whose names I wouldn't mention, you already have the details, have threatened to launch a fresh attack to give this result a bad name and create the impression that indeed that issue was not a problem. For the other commotion as a whole is a liberation. This this city have made a remarkable thing in the life of so guys do you give them daddy with the one that chop the money. I say this money wouldn't chop. If not, then get this land. That money get that money. If not, they are land. That money would that give me a lot of chop. No, they should have conduct another thorough investigation, especially for the sponsors, because now if he has been killed, this the sponsors will contact another person. He is not the only kingpin they know. He's not the most dangerous person they know. Once he has been taken out of the way now, the sponsors will also look for another person that is as dangerous. As he is to... My ear was cut off with that of my friend DK Alabo, who is today sick. He's supposed to be here with us. But I thank the government and the Nigerian police for apprehending him. Tied out in Delta State, where he had encountered with police in the house of his spiritualist, where he went to fortify himself after escaping from the police in a hotel in Iguratu in 2024. 